a lot of people tend to just feel really, really sorry for us and not want to say anything that could potentially upset us. But really, at least a lot of us feel that it's more upsetting that they don't want to talk to us or engage. And we prefer that they know about this. I feel like ignorance is a big one. <laughs> people don't want to take the time to understand what other people are going through and how their version of normal is different from how the rest of the world's version of normal is. They just assume that if you're in a wheelchair, you can't do anything or you're stupid and that your disease affects your mental processing and mine doesn't, but even if it did, you shouldn't treat me as if it does or any less. I'm happy with the way that I am. My life is certainly a lot different than it would be if I didn't have POTS, but I don't think it would necessarily be better. I'm disabled, but I'm not like an inspiration. <laughs> like I hate, like I really don't like that phrase at all. Um, I'd say like me living my day-to-day -day life is not an inspiration because there's like times where I'm like not always on point or I'm not feeling it that day or there's some days where I'm like I don't want to do this like why was I chosen for this. Just because you can't see it doesn't mean it's not there. Like I have an invisible disability. If I wouldn't have just told you that I was blind you probably never would have guessed it. Just keep in mind that different is different. It's not bad <laughs> kind of thing and the more we normalize disability, the easier it'll be on people with disabilities and people without. It'll just make it a overall just normal thing. <laughs>